So the demonstration on Saturday uh, is about democratic rights for everybody in Ontario, not just for school teachers. It's about a government that has attacked its own base and at the same time alienated most people in the province with their austerity program. Well, I'm excited to be at this rally because um, we're not happy with the government. We're hoping the Liberals will get the message at their convention that we're not going away. What an amazing turnout here today! 30,000 of the labor movement! 30,000 of our friends! And 90 community organizations! We used to feel that we were valued uh, by our province and uh, we sure don't feel that now. The Bill 115 is not just about what they've done to teachers, it's about what they can possibly do to every worker in Ontario. I mean, the reality is, is that workers put money into this economy and uh, this economy needs a lift and cutting jobs isn't the way to do it. Why can't we have a different way of looking at the economy? How about investing in the public sector? What's wrong with some, some infusion of dollars to create jobs, making certain that we've got infrastructure program, green energy jobs that can't be exported to China. Well, I think it's important um, for young people to have a voice um, to, and to stand up for their rights. These, the decisions that are being made now are going to affect the future and the future generations. Um, if, we're, if workers are losing their rights today, then it's only going to get worse for young people. We need to get up and stand up. We're looking at $3 billion in health care cuts from the Liberal government. I mean, no family can do without health care. Shame on the Liberal government. When the government loses its sight of who it is that they're representing and about the social programs that we've got in this province, like the bedrock, the two twin bedrocks, social programs has got to be education and health care. And yet they're the two programs that are being assaulted by this austerity program. So my friends, it is way bigger and way more broader than Bill 115. And I'm glad that the teachers today, in solidarity with the rest of the labor movement, recognize that fact, that we're all in this fight together.